Hey, y'all, this is your girl, Cheryl Underwood. Catch Cheryl Underwood Radio Monday through Thursday at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on the hottest station on the planet, Hot7025FM.com. Keep your radio dial right here. You're locked into the hottest news station on the planet, Hot 702.5 in FM Sound. Blazing today's hip-hop, R&B, and pop music. Keeping your radio on fire. Bringing you the hottest, hottest realest, realest, riskiest talk shows Ooh. live 24-7 on Hot7025FM.com. Hey, y'all, it's your girl, Cheryl Underwood, and you're tuned into the hottest news station on the planet, Hot 702.5. Hot 702.5 in FM Sound. Cheryl Underwood Radio. Yes. Home of Cheryl Underwood Radio. Blazing the heat 24-7 on Hot 702.5 FM.com. Hot 702.5. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, yo. Uh, uh, hey, uh, hey, hey. Uh, uh, uh. Yep, yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Live yeah, action. Yeah. Live, live. Live action. Yo, yo, yo. What's yeah. good, man? Glad to have you. Yeah. Man. Glad to have you. What's poppin', Cashavelli? Yeah, yeah. Last yeah. off the station, too, so I'm good. I have it with you, man. Yeah. Glad I have it with you. So, before we start, uh-huh. you know, I got to throw, what's your IGs? Tell everybody your IGs. You already know what it is, Chris Cash. Chris Cash <laughs> underscore <laughs> Vegas. I was waiting for, like, sound effects or something. Like, <laughs> I was playing, I was playing, I was playing. I'm playing. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, What's your yeah, IG, yeah. bro? What's your IG, man? My IG. Follow me on IG. is Sedell underscore notes. That's S-E-D-A-L-E underscore N-O-T-E-S. Man. There it is. Hey, it's yours, Cali man. Boy. DJ Cali Boy. It's DJ C-A-L-I-B-O-I. Boom. Yeah, I yeah. bet you already know. It's your boy, Aaron huh. Stacks. Represent Frequent Flyers and Hot yeah. 702.5. Follow huh. me at E-R-I-C underscore S-T-A-C-K-Z. Don't forget to follow us on the app. You know what I mean? The Mixler app. And also, we're live on Facebook. So, yeah. Hot 702.5 FM. Let's yeah. get it. So, In today, here. we're going to be talking about uh, how to basically start your rap career with no money. You know, mm-hmm. everybody mm-hmm. been through that. We're speaking to the, uh, you know, the artists, like, at the beginning. Uh-huh. But before we get to that, like, the main objective of this is I want, like, the artist to uh, get an understanding of, like, uh, when you guys first started out. So, I want to pick y'all brains. Okay. Uh, I want to know what y'all... How y'all began, okay. where you're from, what you're doing now, and what's your plans to the future. So to start off, like uh tell me to each of y'all, tell me where you're from. And tell me how y'all met too. I'm curious to know this. I'm gonna be asking questions I wanna know too. Okay. Let's start over here then. That's, <laughs> that's a hard one. I, don't, I, don't, I was at? thinking about that the other day. Like I don't uh, remember how we met, but I know it's it's been magic ever since, you know what I'm saying? So So y'all are from Vegas, y'all like I'm I'm born in the Inland Empire, you know, raised I in Southern is. Cali. You know, there it is. is. There yeah. it is. Okay. Watts. 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 You? Yeah, yeah, yeah. From California. I've been out here so damn long though, so I'm pretty much Vegas. <laughs> you see what I mean? What uh what made y'all like make the transition to move over here? So the reason why was music. Like at the end of the day I was just like, I wanna get in music. How the hell am I gonna get in music? I had a few uh family members that were out here. I went to go visit my cousin a few times and then uh just kicking it with my cousin like uh, like a couple summers. Mm-hmm. My cousin was actually looking for a job, and I was just rolling with him. I was like, oh, stop by the radio station. Stop, pull, pull up, pull up right there. <laughs> uh-huh. Hopped out the car. I was like, I walked in, and I was like, yo, what's up, man? I need a job, blah, 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 blah. Or well, we only have street team position, whatever. Uh-huh. I'm, like, I'm like, cool, whatever it is, I got it. Boom, next day, they, they called me that day, did the interview the next day. They hired me. I was like, but yo, I still live in Cali. How are we going to make this work? <laughs> I was like. I was like, I could work every other weekend uh-huh. and just I could go back and forth. But if that's cool, if that's cool with y'all, then we could do that. So I just started commuting back and forth from Cali to Vegas on my street team shit. So and then eventually, you know, the rest is history. After shit, that. I can tell you, re- y'all really want it. You really, really want yeah, it. A lot of yeah. people lazy. They wouldn't even, people be scared to move up the block. Yeah. So mm-hmm. uh, tell me, what's your story? I want everybody to know. What's your story, yeah. man? You give me a little brief. Man, one. I'm, I'm trying to interrogate. I've been all over. I've been all over. I've been all over. I'm from Watts. Mm-hmm. I came out here to. LA met up with this guy right here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, so like I met him and a week later I was with Cash <laughs> The crazy <laughs> thing about it, so he he's one of the newest he's one of the newest members of the Cash <laughs> Valley squad. <laughs> you know what I mean? But um and I was tripping out because like he put himself in, in, in a in a great position. Like he's in a great position now and, and he's you know c- consistently moving up and uh progressing and, mm-hmm. and getting promoted to different things and, and you know what I'm saying, handling a lot of different things. And I'm like, how did you know? Like you know what I'm saying? Cause I meet a lot of cats, bro. I meet a lot of cats, they talk that jazz, they you know what I'm saying, they say Oh yeah, I'm gonna fuck with you, blah 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 blah. You know what I'm saying? And then 
I was just like, this motherfucker just slid right in. I was like, <laughs> I was like what you breathe. I was like, yeah, yeah, it must be bullshit. So yeah, I, I, was, I was like, yeah. how did you know? Like, and then and first I was, thing I told him was, I can show you better than I can tell yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then, um, and then, and then now that I'm seeing him, mm. I'm kind of like, damn, you in a great position. Because when I moved to Vegas, I ain't had shit. Like, I ain't had, I had to figure everything out. Like, if I had moved to Vegas and I had, you know what I'm saying, somebody already, like, laid the groundwork, uh -huh. and I would have just been following him, you know what I'm saying? I'd have been, like, you know. Yeah, yeah, I'm in a position now yeah, to try to yeah, figure, yeah, <laughs> figure yeah, it out. Yeah, he yeah, said he got an interview. I'm right on that coattail, boy. We going together. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what about you, man? You mysterious yeah. over there, man. Um, what about you? Man, um, <laughs> shout out to my boy, man. I was I was on an independent record label. Uh -huh. uh, we uh, relocated to Miami, and, um, you know, stuff starts slowing up. Shout out to my boy Split Star out there mm -hmm. with Paper Rock, the whole game. But it's Cassavelli over here right yeah. now. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, man, everybody was giving me that call. Like, I was, I'm was, i like, it's slowing down out here. Like, I need to make a move. Everybody's saying, come to Vegas, come to Vegas. And, um, yeah, I definitely met Chris Cash. And um, from there, it was kind of like the same story. You're mm -hmm. like, oh, I'm going to get with you. And then timing and timing. Then once I finally got up with him, man, it was just magic. This this boy is incredible. <laughs> Hard work and entrepreneur. Yeah, man, I've been seeing them been working out yeah. here. Man. Before you got moved out here, I've been seeing it, like, working, yeah. working hard, man. I, yeah. I really admired it about you working hard, man. Thank got you. your team. Thank you. You know Thank what I mean? You. So, um, what, uh, since you was talking, we'll start from you, but um, mm -hmm. what inspired you to get into, like, the music and the hip-hop scene or whatever? Like, take me back. Like, you know what? Take me back. I grew up, my, my father's a hustler, shout out to him. One mm -hmm. Um. You know, he he was he had his fa uh, our own family uh, record shop, so mm. we had a lot of people coming in and DJs and artists and stuff like that. You know, out in Southern Cali, so I had a lot of influences that were coming in, and I was like, man, I need to get involved. And, and you know, my pops was like, you need to just start working, like work towards it, and um, you you can get it. It's out here. You mm -hmm. see the network. You see you see the access we got, and you know, I just stuck stuck with it, and man, it's been a journey. You know what I'm saying? I'm just still hustling with it, you mm -hmm. know, I'm DJing now, doing a little radio stuff and definitely trying to flex out with uh Cachavelli, man. <laughs> yeah. And Chang make sure I'm in squad. that in that uh tree, you know. Okay. What I'm so you what uh what inspired you like way back what inspired uh, you to get into this music thing? Bone thugs and harmony. Oh, that's the same. Yeah. Bone, that's my. That's my. Bone thugs, bro. I'm a big Bone thugs fan. I like yeah. it. I like it. Music comes <laughs> in that category. You know okay. what I'm saying? Okay. That's what um, got me into the music. I like. It. I mm. love. Yeah. I, regular kids was getting toys and stuff like mm -hmm. that for Christmas. I was getting piano lessons. <laughs> and, and just anything involving music, mm -hmm. I was I was just so like intrigued by it. So I just pursued it to the fullest. I've been doing it professionally for like ten years. Ten years, oh yeah. So like, mm. I just want to keep pushing, and I believe uh, if you're gonna pursue something, know it. All of it, all aspects to the best of your ability. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, you yes, got sir. a point, man. So, you what got you into this thing? Uh, take me back because I wasn't tall enough to play basketball. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's all rappers that we were talking about. <laughs> <play> basketball. <laughs> Real talk, basketball, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna, <laughs> basketball was my first love. I loved it, I was nice. In, in, in you know what I'm saying my, my neighborhood I was nicest in, in my area and, shit. Mm. <laughs> and then after you know what I'm saying after high school, I realized. These motherfuckers is really tall. Damn, I ain't even grow. Like these motherfuckers <laughs> is really tall, and I had to make a decision. Like, like after senior year, and like you know what I'm saying, after we won our league championship, uh -huh. and then we went to you know what I'm saying the CIO, and I was like, these motherfuckers is tall as fuck. Mm -hmm. I was, I had to really like decide, like, yo, I gotta, like, if, I, yeah, I could pursue basketball, and I, I could make it to the league, like you know what I'm saying, like, uh -huh. like you, know, you could do, I could do that. There's people out there that did that, but will I be great at it? Yeah, and I was like. <laughs> I don't know if I, I want to work that hard just to make it. I want to I want to work hard to be great. You know mm. what I mean? And I was like, what's my next What's my next outlet of passion? And music was always been my passion. You know what I'm saying? Like, like going to the basketball court. I'm always listening to music. I'm always like freestyling. Like you know what I'm saying? Mess with the homie. Like uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? Like so that was my next passion. So I was like, what's the next thing that I would love to do as a dream? As, as that I I could do every day. <laughs> And it'll be worth it, and I could kick it with my homies and shit like that. And music was it. And, and from that uh -huh. day on, I was just like full time music. And what really gassed me up was like, like, cause you know how how, how you get that that, with, especially that time in, in your life, you're like, damn, I don't know if this is gonna work or you, you, yeah, yeah, you don't yeah. you don't know, right? You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. it gassed me up to just go all in. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go all the way in, and at the very worst, at at the very worst thing that could happen is I end up with knowledge. You know what I mean? I'm like, well, that's not True. bad. That's not bad. That's and I went all the way in, like, and I've been, I've been, I've been going in since. So. so a personal question I want to ask, like, um, I noticed it seemed like you running a label, you got your your yeah. boys, and it seemed like yeah. they respect you. How do uh -huh. you um, 
Like, what was the first thing you did, like, as far as leadership skills? Like, how do you maintain all these personalities, especially when all you guys seem to rap too? How do you maintain, right. like, make sure there's no egos and <laughs> keep the leadership and make sure everybody right. moving the unit? Lead by example, mm -hmm. a action, you know what I'm saying? Action, um, anything, anything I ask of anybody, I wouldn't do myself. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Anything I ask of anybody, I've already done. Mm -hmm. Anything I ask of anybody, um, it's it's to make them better. Like okay. you know what I'm, saying? I'm not just making people like because I meet a lot. I don't know meet a lot of people, but just you know you just meet those cats that just want to be like titles don't mean shit to me. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like 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 oh you like whatever like oh I'm the boss of this. I'm CEO of this. I'm like you whatever like whatever. <laughs> you get the, you know what I'm saying? You get the job done. Like uh -huh. what, how do you get busy? And that's and that's all that 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 really matters. You know what I mean? Like and and that's and, and I feel and I'm genuine and I'm transparent and if. If if I need to be checked, if somebody check me like yo, you need to, I'm like, and I think about like you right, <laughs> you right, you know what I'm saying, and you know I think you just lead by example. Really. Okay, you know what I mean. So had you always had um like when you was doing music, did you always had a plan to do the label thing or what? Did that? Yeah, yeah. Actually, I when I started doing music, I started I wanted to be a manager and just uh -huh. just manage shit. But then I realized you can't make nobody do anything that they want to do, and you know what I'm saying, and like and like it was just I was in a situation to where like. I had all these cats, and I I wasn't rapping, but I was telling everybody, yo, I just booked this, I just got this, like, uh -huh. mother, like, and then like people wouldn't do the shit, and I'm just like, yo, <laughs> why am I working this hard? And at the end of the day, my artist could just not do it, and I can't do nothing about it. You know what I'm saying? True. And, I, and I was like, you know what, fuck that, I'm gonna do it then. Like, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. and, and that's how my my old, my whole attitude with everything that that I do. If the shit don't get done, I'm gonna do it. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, so either you do it or I'm gonna do it or I'm gonna find someone to do it. But it's gonna get done, and Facts. that's and, and that's and that's the reason why. Right. Like, I, you know, I started I started rapping. And I was like, you know what? I'm nice, man. I'm gonna go ahead. And do it. <laughs> go ahead and get I'm gonna just go ahead and do it. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, like, uh, without telling like the the sauce, you know, and telling no secrets, uh -huh. like, um, what's y'all near plan future? Like, the stuff y'all can't share. Like, what's mm. the what's the plans for the near goal? Let me know. I, I like how you Secure said that. Bag. I like how you said that. <laughs> Secure the bag. There Secure you go. The bag. There you go. <laughs> My daughter's hungry, bro. There you wow. go. That's the that's the, that's oh, the that's thing. Theories. You uh, that. Cash. I mean, what? you want me to do it? I mean, y'all all can do it. Y'all can take turns. I want to hear from you. I'll take care of it. All right. So 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 the objective right now is get this single popping. We got this new single called Birkins. Right. Birkins on Birkins on Birkins. I'm gonna play that. That's your hot. Um. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And 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 um. That's the plan because as far as any any other strategy that we got, we got we done did it. You know saying like we talking about content, we talking about content, we talking about music, we talking mm -hmm. about in the studio every day, we talking about vlogging, we talking about radio shows, we talk about uh, uh, reaction. Like mm. we've done all that. We talking about IG, we talking about whatever people think we doing shows. Yeah, yeah, like, I do. Know. Um, since you bring that back yeah. up, we talking about marketing. Obviously, yeah, I ain't gonna get too deep in that now. Okay. But uh, I do fuck with y'all brand. Y'all not like um, yeah, y'all just don't just rap y'all right, interesting right. across the board and right, i do right and, and and that's another thing that got me gassed up to um to just really do all this uh -huh. shit because like when i started you know i wasn't i wasn't the best you know what i'm saying rapper and that you know saying that that could fuck with your you know what i'm saying your ego and yeah, shit like yeah. that you're like oh man if i'm not the best but then I, I told myself this i was like hey you know what i mean like say i'm not the best rapper right mm -hmm. but then you have this guy that's really really good but shit, I know how to market myself. Yeah. Or, you know what I'm saying? I got a style that's not your style. You may have the best bars and your punchlines is fucking crazy and awesome, but do the girls like you? Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Like, like, can you get yeah. booked for a show? Can you know what I mean? Uh -huh. Like, I'm like, right. you, you could, and I'm saying, can you get your shit? Do you know how to use social media? Do you know how to use these, 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 do you have connections? You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like, right. so at right. the end of the day, like, you could be the best rapper to your three homeboys and shit, or, you know what I'm saying? You could be a good rapper and everybody know you. I'm like, mm -hmm. Right. I'm after that. But I'm after. It's a business. At the end of the day, it's a business. It's a <laughs> lifestyle. It's a thing. And, uh -huh. and at the end of the day, I don't want to be the hardest rapper with you know what I'm saying a bunch of guys talking super lyrical shit. And I'd rather be an okay rapper with like five women and we drinking and chilling. And, <laughs> and I'm with my homies and, and we all just having uh -huh. fun. Like you know what I mean? So yeah, yeah. yeah. Like uh, I do message y'all brand. That's why I said like uh, we've been uh, kind of conversating on IG for. Yeah. But I feel like I knew you already before. Yeah, this yeah. is actually no, our first time meeting in person. Yeah, that's that's crazy. But I feel yeah, like I yeah. knew you already because the uh -huh. brand is so clear, and yeah. I, I do respect that a lot of people. Yeah. I do think needs to work on their branding more. So mm -hmm. like I do definitely respect uh, the brand. Like yeah. did did y'all consciously think of this or did oh. it just happen? It's fall so into place? Like, oh yeah, you know that's the uh, that's some some mastermind guy. That's the that. guy. <laughs> some, 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 some guy that's very wise that uh, I know you just wake up, boom, I know brand, that. Drop, brand. Drop knowledge and stuff. <laughs> no, no. no, but it's genuine though too. Yeah. So I feel like it had to be easy because like if I meet you now, you actually like 
how you seem online. That's what's up. That's so what's up. I know it could have been that that hard at least. Oh I'm man, you know we just make things look easy. You know? <laughs> it should take a lot. Of, it should take a lot of work. It take a lot of hard work, dedication, real talk, and, uh -huh. and focus and shit. Like um, I'm I'm really just addicted to work. Like mm -hmm. I'm addicted to work. I'm addicted to work and learning. You know what I'm saying work, learning, and, and family. You know mm -hmm. what I mean, like, and and that's that's all I stick my, you know what I mean, like like my energy and my focus into. And if they don't fall into that category, mm -hmm. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I get mad at myself that day. <laughs> you know I mean? So as far as the, uh, as far as like, you, I know y'all got the new song out. I heard it, uh -huh. Fire Again. Yeah, uh, they, they, are y'all working on a whole, like? We, collective or you know what like, what like, like the main thing that I focus at Cash Valley Music is just to mm. create music like yeah. create 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 music and then we, we we decide what we do with it after that you know what I'm saying I never like I never want to put music and business in the same category mm -hmm. like, there's time alright boom create create we create mm -hmm. and if it boom it's time to market alright then we market you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying but we just make music, you know what I'm saying? We just make music. Um, he got a project going, he got a project working. We all got a collective project going. We got multiple projects. And the, and the crazy thing about me is like, I'm, I'm a rapper, like I rap, rap. I, I, mean, I, I do music, so I got, mm -hmm. I got projects with a bunch of different artists. Like, mm -hmm. like, I got a full project with this cat. I got a full project with this cat. I got a full project with this cat, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? I got a full collective project. As soon as this motherfucker get his shit together, and you know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people deal with a lot of different problems yeah, and yeah, shit yeah. like that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. He's not focused. But as soon as you get this shit together, maybe we could put that project out. But we, it's it's there, it's there, right. you know what I'm saying? And, mm -hmm. I, and, and I don't like, and some people like think, oh man, I just wasted my bars. Like me, like I feel creativity is abundant. Uh -huh. Like the, the more you use it, the more it's gonna come. So me, that's nothing, like, oh yeah, that's the same way I, I made that full project, and I made that make sense. I can make another one. Like, yeah, you're gonna get better and better. Yeah, yeah. Like, mm -hmm. like when I first started, like when I was really serious about. No, no I'm always serious, but like when I was like, yo, I need to be a better rapper, mm -hmm. like better recording artist. We were doing three to four, five songs a day. Like, God damn, some Tupac. Yeah, we were <laughs> doing Tupac. three, five, four songs a day. <laughs> boom, boom. We was knocking it out. Like, and this is before. This is before them. Like, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? And I had when I when I first opened the studio, I had like. 15 rappers come through that motherfucker. Like, everybody uh -huh. wanted to rap. Everybody wanted to freestyle. Everybody wanted to do that. As soon as it came down to, like, the business, like, okay, now we got to sit down and really see how we do this. Uh -huh. Where y'all at? Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, what, most people ain't. That's how you know who real, too. Yeah, like, yeah, most yeah. people ain't, like, oh, thank you, thank you. they don't seem to be too interested outside of, the like, the fun stuff, the rapping and the, you know what I mean? Yeah, so that's how you know who yeah, serious. Yeah, because there's a lot of bullshit that you got to do. Or not a bullshit, but there's a lot of things that you don't want to do, but you got to learn how to do. For example, like, social media. Like, I don't like doing social media shit. That's crazy me either, but yeah, you can tell between me and you either. Yeah, yeah, but, but it's like... I was saying that last week, like, you think I love... I don't really like it. Yeah, I don't want to yeah. do this shit, but, but, I, but I was sitting there, I had all this music, and I'm like, how the fuck am I going to get this shit out? Uh -huh. And then it said social media. Okay, I'm like, all right, well, let me learn this shit. And I learned this shit, you know what I'm saying? And like, and like, and like a lot of people, the outside looking in, they think, oh, it's easy to you. It's easy to you. Hell no, it's, like, it's a job, yeah. man. Like another... It's yeah. easy because while you was partying, I was fucking on my computer learning this shit. Right. You know what I mean? Like, and, 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 then, and then I post that I'm partying. Like, and so uh -huh. you think, so you think yeah. that's that? That's you know what I'm saying? I might give y'all too much game. I'm just going. <laughs> nah, I'll be turning up. I'll be turning up doing drugs, fucking bitches. You know what I mean? That's all I be doing. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, so uh, he said y'all got like separate projects. Like, where can they find it? Is it out or not out yet? Not Even y'all got some stuff that's like right. already put out or whatever. Right now, I'm working on doing this video for Petty Goes gonna be my single mm -hmm. for um hashtag notes stay confident mm -hmm. yeah. the name of the project yeah. okay that will be coming out uh -huh. october 26th october we'll do, uh listening party on the 24th that's my birthday also 32 well, oh yeah you know i'm just trying to focus on perfecting my craft man I'm, I'm doing pretty good man i just feel like uh -huh. i grow and progress with each one i do yeah for sure what yeah. you got? What you got, man? Um, you know, man, I, I, we been in, uh, on and off working on records and stuff mm -hmm. like that. Like yeah. him, him, he wasn't around when I was around before, right. so he got incredible energy and work yeah. ethic. Mm -hmm. So they both crazy. Like we, can I tell them about the news? Go can, we got this. We got this joint <laughs> called Drug Rats. Uh -huh. We uh -huh. wait for cats to get on. Oh there. yeah, I'm on it. Yeah, it's crazy. I'm on it. So um, look forward to that. I got an EP with my man Spliff Star. Mm -hmm. yeah. The warm up. I'm looking on re. Yeah. Filtering that out on yeah. the internet and stuff like that, or distribution wise, right. or whatever, and that's <laughs> yeah. that's about it. You know what I'm saying? But the Just main to keep thing, the main thing we promoting right now is Birkins. Birkins oh yeah, Birkins, Birkins, yeah. Birkins. Oh yeah, it oh yeah, got, oh yeah, got oh yeah. Birkins, Birkins. It Matter got released fact, yesterday. Yeah. Tell them where to find it at. Is Birkins, find it at. Spotify. Go to Spotify. Mm -hmm. If you got anything else, go to that too. But Spotify, mm -hmm. add me on Spotify. Yeah. Get them Spotify numbers. Up. I'm gonna focus on Spotify. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I fuck with Tidal. I fuck with Apple Music. Yeah, uh, I yeah fuck with Spotify. All, all, but Spotify, <laughs> I fuck with that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? 
Get that, you know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's everywhere. That's the record. If you a DJ, spin the record. Show the record love, man. And and that's the campaign we on right now because out of everything that we've done, or, mm-hmm. let me give you guys another jewel. <laughs> another jewel, all right? So, that's what this show about. Get them. Another jewel. Them. This is another jewel. If, if you guys are struggling or you're trying to figure out what's the next play or whatnot, you need to focus on one thing. Mm-hmm. Focus on one thing, one goal, and put all your effort and energy into, into that, that one goal until it's accomplished. Me, as an entrepreneur, as a creative thinker, I am all over. The, I started out all over the place. Everything is more organized now, okay. mm-hmm. but I started off all over the place. And I, you know, what I'm saying because I'm thinking the more the better. Like I'm doing all these things, but the the way this shit is is like uh, you gotta have focus in order to really. Bring that heat and really okay. Let, let me t- take a light. Let me let me do this little 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 visualization. Magnifying glass. You got a magnifying glass, right? You got the sun hitting the magnifying glass. If you all over the place, you're not going to heat up that right. that, that, that ant, area, that yeah. ant, or yeah, that, yeah. That, that, that 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 that. You, you got to focus. Fast. You got to focus that sunlight to, to hit that thing. Right on the ant. That's fucked up. Yeah. Yeah. I, I, did, I did a few times and I felt bad after that. That's, that's not a burn. I am a pyromaniac guy. I like I like fire. I really yeah. like fire. You know what I'm saying? So. Hot yeah. 702 hey, That's why you're here, man. That's, that's why you're here. But you know what's funny? Yeah. Like with Cash, he's he's a you know he he's dope on radio. You know what I'm saying? Oh, so thank you, thank you. He's like, yeah. He he loves the music more than doing the radio. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. And then I came, I started out doing music, like producing music, uh-huh. and rapping, and then it's like now I'm transitioning to, into radio. Yeah. And I'm telling him, I'm like, dude, don't leave the, don't stop the radio, uh, like. Yeah. But that's yeah, like when he asked me, out, not to cut you off. Yeah, like when he yeah, asked yeah. me, I was like, uh, "What I like about this is like I get a, a extra extension of creativity yeah. outside that I can't do in music." So, right. yeah. and it kind of make the music a little more. By the time you get back to the music, you yeah. have a new, new spark of creativity. Yeah, so. yeah, right, yeah. Right. So we found a new outlet. So um, I started my YouTube channel. Uh-huh. Um, well, I've been had the YouTube channel, so we do we do a reaction video. Mm-hmm. So our reaction videos have uh, twelve thousand subscribers mm-hmm. on YouTube. We gained uh, ten thousand subscribers in the last. Four to five months. Where they can find you on YouTube. Crazy. YouTube, Cashavelli TV. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Chris Cash, Cashavelli TV. Word. You're going to find it. We there doing, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> just, just look like, we ain't hard to find. Chris Cash, Cashavelli TV. Burgers, burgers, burgers. <laughs> right, Vegas. right, right. Burgers. It, you know say you just <laughs> search Google, me? any of those, you're you going to find my YouTube. You're going to find, we, like, we there, we putting up numbers. And that's just another creative outlet because when we do the video stuff, I've always been a visual person. Uh-huh. Like, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just fell into radio because that was the opportunity and I ran with it and I did well and I rose to the top. And I'm like, mm-hmm. okay, this is cool. What's next? Boom. So I started my own label and everything like that. And I'm like, yo, what's next? Like, I still need that creative outlet mm-hmm. because that radio is a creative outlet, you know? Yeah. Um, but I didn't own that radio station. No. You know and I mean? that's why <laughs> I didn't own it. I so. wanted you to come over there with me, but you. you Go what? I wanted you <laughs> to come over there to dash, you know, shameless plug. But oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. yeah so. Your know. voice sounds like a real radio voice. <laughs> right. Oh, uh, right. thank you. Thank right. you, bro. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so okay. uh, before we get into the uh, concept of like, teaching an up and coming artist, uh, uh-huh. let me yeah. know. Since we're promoting a new single, let me yeah. know like what was how did y'all come up with that single? Did it just happen or so the the in, the, the, sing, no. the single was in, was was inspired by uh, this big sports better in Las Vegas, uh-huh. um, Vegas Dave. Oh, that was that line you. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah, 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 I yeah, get it. yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, we've been just. It's, I, I had did another video uh-huh. um, oh, last the bottom of last year. Um, because I had another guy that 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 we had brought to the team. He was a YouTuber because uh-huh. we were trying to figure out the YouTube t- thing. Mm-hmm. So he was a big YouTuber, millions and millions of scri- subscribers, whatever. So I had linked up with him, and then we were making this video. I'm like, oh, how do I make this video pop? I need somebody that just represent this Vegas shit, like just oh, whatever. Mm-hmm. So I hit up Vegas Dave on the fly, like just on the IG, or whatever, and he hit me back. And then we did that music video. That deal or that situation uh-huh. didn't work out, but me and Vegas, they we were just cool, we were just you know what I'm saying, just kept in contact. And then he hit me up not too long ago. He's like, "Yo, can you make me a song?" I'm like, <laughs> "I think I, you know what I'm saying." I'm, uh-huh. like, I'm like, "Cool, cool, cool." But then you know, you know, with me and, and me and my brand and our brand and shit, Cashavelli Music, we don't do nothing like whack or nothing corny and shit like that. You know what I mean? Like we don't, we don't, we don't just be like, "Okay, we going all right." Like, that's like good yeah, idea. Just, yeah, let's, <laughs> let's do it. Okay, you know what I'm saying? It just, uh-huh. I just, I just had to have the right the right uh, inspiration and the right point of view. Uh-huh. So I wrote the record in the point of view of this guy, you know what I mean, of, uh-huh. of him. Like, what, like if he was a rapper, if I was in his position, 
what would I rap about? And, 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 and he, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and, yeah. And his last person and on, on his last last post, he's posting all these uh, Birkins and shit. Like uh-huh. so he got like <laughs> hell Birkins. You know what I'm saying? Wow. And, and, and a Birkin is like like half a million dollars. Like you know what I mean? Like you know what I'm saying? So True definition of secure the bag, right? There. You feel me? Like and he said, like he really. Been, I'm so I'm like so shit. If I was in Birkins on Birkins on Birkins on, bro. We working, we working. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So, but I wrote that, and I feel that's that's what a, that's what a rapper does. Like that's what the, the greatest rappers do is be mm-hmm. able to tell a story in a certain point of view and make that shit like real you know mm-hmm. what I mean like as far as Bur- I don't got no Birkins but shit like you know what I'm saying the motherfucker old boy had, that old boy had a Bugatti like you know what I mean like <laughs> come on let's, let's, go get the Birkins go get that Birkins. you feel me like, save up for it you know get what I'm saying yeah right. you, gotta, you gotta speak shit into existence and one thing that one thing that I love about music or speech and, 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 and words and, and, and songs and everything like that I'm not even going. I'm not even going bullshit. When I came to Vegas, I was broke as fuck. I didn't know nobody. Mm-hmm. I, you know what I'm saying? I didn't. I, you know what I'm saying? Like, but I started rapping all these things that I wanted. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? The bands, the money, the girls, the, right. the partying. You know what I mean? <laughs> and then all everything happened. Like, Bro, me not, listening to y'all, uh, your music too. Um, it it sound like you really talking about the stuff you be doing, honestly. Oh yeah, I mean, like, wait, it depends what we talking. Most about. Most of it, I, 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 yeah. I be trying to tell him <laughs> to chill. He be, he be talking, he be saying, telling yeah. too much. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, you know what I mean. But it's it's all art, you know what I mean. Uh-huh. It's, it's all art, and, and it's a form of expression. It's either everything that I'm talking about is is either true that I've done, or I've I've seen people mm-hmm. do, or I've been, uh, you know what I mean, very accustomed to being around mm-hmm. these people and stuff like that. So it, it is it, it comes. From from a definitely authentic mm-hmm. place, um, yeah. Yeah, no more talking about killing ants with micro- <laughs> ma- magnifying glasses. <laughs> what you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> he was definitely that kid, bro. Nah, I was. <laughs> I was just seeing who picked that so, up. So, <laughs> so we can get on the topic now. Yeah. Well, I want a lot of people on Instagram. I don't know okay. if you're where I do a little rap mentoring thing on the side. Yeah, yeah. So a lot of my fans, they uh. usually always ask me, uh-huh. like, uh. How do I start rapping? Then I tell them, and the main thing they usually have, they always say, the what the main problem they usually have uh-huh. is the lack of budget. Right. Now, one of the things, do y'all have any like advice for like uh let's say for like mm-hmm. you had little to no money. And okay. assuming that you have enough to like, you know what I mean, basic stuff like cell phone and boom boom boom. Right, if you don't right, have a right. cell phone or nothing, you ain't gonna be watching this anyway. Right. So right. assuming talking. you have little to no budget, uh-huh. what'll be like some of the advice y'all give that are like for artists to like at least get started. I know yeah. you're gonna need a budget to take off, but to yeah. at least get the blueprint down before they can get to the budget eventually. Yeah. Like what advice would you yeah. anyone y'all want to give? I'm keep it one hundred. Yeah, get money. Like mm-hmm. get money and learn how to get money. I mean mm-hmm. that's 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 it was saying like that's that's it. Learn how to get money. You're gonna need money to make it happen. Like. I know people want to hear some magical fucking formula <laughs> and shit like that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Get money. Get money. Or you know what I'm saying how how are you gonna get money? Is mm-hmm. it is it are you gonna be like just the dopest rapper alive that you're gonna find an investor that's gonna invest in your shit? Right. I don't know. Get money. Mm-hmm. Whatever the fuck. Get money. Like you're gonna yeah. have to get money because like a lot of people be like, oh, how do you do it with no budget? So that's you're already setting yourself up for failure. Yeah, so when you, you gotta so, you gotta yeah. get that budget at some point. You gotta have like, something. I, I do say like at least if. Cause I, uh, a lot of I don't want the the lack of budget to necessarily hinder people from stopping. Right. I'll say at least you have time. Like at right. least create content until you can get that budget too. Cause right, a lot right, of times, right. like right. a lot right. of people ask me too, they'll uh, they'll be like, "Well, how do I do this? You can load up. I mean, it's kind of easy today. Right, you got right, a cell right. phone, yeah. I'm yeah, assuming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can load up a freestyle and yeah, right. Right. at least get the content down right. even before you get the budget. But you're gonna need that budget to right, right, right. At some point, like you need you're gonna need it. Right. Right. Get you right. a, BS mic, bro. Exactly. Mic. Exactly. Like, but that still costs money, bro. That still costs money. Yeah, true, true. I'm assuming. I know, but you yeah. can. Yeah, this I with the assumption that. that you got some fucking money. Like, you know what I mean? Well, yeah, I yeah, mean, so, if I mean, you broke, I say use your resources, man. Just hustle, bro. Uh, okay, I yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Matter of fact, speak on that. That do make sense. I, I just, I mean, I think you you, you got to hustle. Use your resources, like network. You know, like put right. yourself out there as much as you can yeah. with what you have, even if you got a little. Mike, that's only in the computer. Like, <laughs> do okay, what you can okay. until right. you can get to into a better position. Shit, I remember right. when I was like, like yeah. back then, didn't have no fucking budget. Shit, I right. load the cell phone, do free. You can vlog right. this right. shit. I okay. know you got a cell phone. Okay. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can type beats on YouTube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Exactly. Instagram yeah. raps. Exactly. Instagram yeah. raps. Yeah, a lot yeah. of y'all like. Like y'all got to get a budget, like he said. You're right. gonna learn how to get money. Right. You're gonna yeah. learn how to get money. But yeah. in the meantime, you yeah. don't want to necessarily just do nothing. Right. So I say like load. 
get your cell phone. They got decent quality. Right. Or do some Instagram freestyles over some type beats until you can get that budget. But mm-hmm. right, you right. definitely like, you know what I mean? I remember when I when it was kind of rough. You yeah, know what I mean? Well, let, 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 me, let, let me rephrase my answer. Man. Uh-huh. If you got no budget, you know what I'm well, saying? Well, little to yeah. no. I'm assuming yeah, they got like a bait of some yeah. 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 Work. Yeah. Like just uh-huh. work. Put out content, you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. I, as you were saying, mm-hmm. and and um, people right now, y'all in the fucking greatest position. Ever. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Ever, <laughs> I know what you're about to. Yeah, I feel you. Ever, <laughs> anybody can do. Anything ever, right like now. you can make this shit happen to get to get started. To get uh-huh. started. To get to, started. To, yeah. to get started. To do, you know what I'm saying? The the level, you know what I'm saying? Just to get, you know what I mean? Like in there, there's no excuse. There's no excuse because because okay, say you don't have no money. Say you don't even have a cell phone. He got a cell phone. Yo, film yeah, me real yo, quick. Yo, homie got it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, like, film me real quick. Oh, film me real quick. You got, you got, you got Instagram posted. Like, you know what I'm saying, like, how do you, st- like, you yeah, you gotta like, be resourceful. Like, when you lack money, you got time, and yeah. you got, if you're yeah, an artist, you gotta be resourceful. Yeah, yeah. it's other people just like them so it's yeah. just like you so yeah. a lot of times you can network people on the same level you can even yeah. barter resources let's yeah. say like you said you yeah. don't got a cell phone right. well your homie yeah. got the cell phone yeah. but you may got the mic y'all better link up and well, like you know yeah. what I mean just there don't let go. it defeat you and stuff so like yeah it's just um it's all about your work ethic yeah your yeah. work ethic use a little creativity outside the music you just gotta be uh-huh. resourceful eventually you will get that budget you yeah. know what I mean mm-hmm. but until then yeah I mean a budget ain't gonna and, and then I, I look at it too it's good practice so by the time you do yeah. get the budget and you already have an idea then opposed right. to like Right. Having a budget and it's starting off all random and stuff. Right. You know what right. I mean? Real so talk. But what about even when you got a budget, like it's investors and stuff that try to get in the music business and they put mu- they put money into all of these different things but mm-hmm. they end up going nowhere. Yeah, yeah. So That's how, why how do you how do you not run into that? You know, even if Wait. you get a little budget after you, you didn't have the budget at first uh-huh. and then you come up on some money, right. you wanna do your music thing like what steps should people take? Really? I honestly think that's why, like, you right. gotta cherish the. the uh, <laughs> honestly, think in my opinion, that's why you gotta cherish <laughs> the think, beginning bro. stages. Oh yeah. So absolutely. while you're doing the beginning stages, about time you do get there, you'll have some, some idea. Of, yeah, you yeah. just won't be like blind, yeah. Yeah. throwing your money True. at the wall. True. Yeah. Like a lot of stuff I learned was just like trying to figure stuff out. Like, mm-hmm. you know, it's kind of like entrepreneurship. Sometimes you gotta it test is, stuff yeah. out, put right. stuff in the market before exactly. you throw the real money. You know, test it out. Even yeah. If it's ten dollars, that's smart. Throw it out. Test right, it, right. Yeah. whatever. Get once eventually you'll build like a case study of you know what works and what don't. Yeah. Right. So that's how I recommend like right. enjoy that small time when you yeah. don't got the budget. Enjoy that. Exactly. You got tons of time right. for that's creativity. Smart. I'm pretty sure yeah. you can agree. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah, you absolutely. got a lot. Of, you play a lot of roles now. I know you. Uh-huh. Sometimes yes, I know you kind of miss when you could just rap. <laughs> I know oh, sometimes yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I yeah, mean. Yeah, yeah. As no, far absolutely. as from a maybe not from a business standpoint, but as far as for the love of the art. Absolutely, yeah, 100%. So. I like, I like, I tell everybody all the time, yo, I'm doing all this other shit <laughs> to get us in position to, to uh-huh. you know what I'm saying? To, and I'm pretty to, sure it, it, you gradually, you know what I mean, yeah. got, got to that level. You didn't yeah, wake up yeah. overnight and stuff, you yeah, know what I mean? Like I said, when I first started, you know, when I opened up my studio, I was in, I was all I was doing was music. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's all I was doing. And then I had a whole bunch of music, and I was just like, well, shit, I need people fucking hear the music <laughs> <laughs> oh, matter of fact I, I do remember in the earlier you said you was you start off as vegas as broke right so this is uh-huh. perfect yeah how like what was your first like mind state to even get your stuff started you know what like, i mean? I, I was like i gotta give me some money <laughs> <laughs> Right. And, and you know what I'm saying, and then, <laughs> yeah. and then, yeah. some money <laughs> because, because I came to Vegas with a with a clean with a clean mind state. Uh-huh. Where, like you know what I'm saying, I left all my Cali shit. You know what I'm saying in Cali, Cali, Cali. You know what I mean. So I left all all that shit. I was like, yo, I'm, I'm about to be here. I'm about to be just the you know what I'm saying the hardest working guy, or whatever. So I'm and I'm working all these jobs and I'm busting my ass. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like you said, get some money. <laughs> and I'm busting my ass and I'm like, fuck, this shit is not going how I want it to go. Uh-huh, so I was yeah. just like. <laughs> I gotta give me some money. You know what I'm saying? My name is Cash for a reason. So yeah, I yeah. Get, get cash. that money. I went to get Cash money, and then <laughs> ever since then, everything not not everything was like all good, but it, it, uh-huh. it just it just progressed a lot a lot faster. And then now I'm into the level where I built a certain you know foundation. So now I'm looking at the next level of mm-hmm. the thing. So there's like a next uh, you know way of train of thought to get the money like, uh-huh. like, we, like it's easy to say yeah get money get money and shit like that. I was like, <laughs> yeah. get some money you, you know what it's I mean? a lot that, of money out. you can get some exactly and one one thing that i can uh that i love vegas for mm-hmm. and and i that's why i always rep vegas because i'm from cali but vegas showed me the game mm-hmm. so that's why i rep vegas I, I got so much opportunity in vegas i've been here so long i learned the game in vegas Vegas had given me the opportunity to be around motherfuckers with real money, like right. real money. Like right. the whole concept of money 
has changed ever since I've been to Vegas. Mm -hmm. right. Because like when I was in Cali, you didn't you didn't you didn't come across a lot of people that 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 can blow ten grand like nothing right. or win twenty nah, grand like nah. nothing. I'm, I'm, from, I'm, day. I'm, I'm from Chicago. I ain't. Right. You, know what I'm saying? you never. You never. <laughs> I'll see that shit. And, and, and me yeah. me going to Vegas and then I like I worked at the radio station and I worked at the nightclub. Uh huh. So when I was in the nightclub and stuff like that, I met these. These people that money was not like it was really like mm -hmm. you now people say, yeah, money ain't nothing but a number or like just whatever, mm -hmm. whatever, whatever, whatever the fuck that is. Like yeah, motherfucker, cause you got it, but you don't. You know, but then when I meet these people, it really ain't like mm -hmm. cause the motherfuckers that have a bunch of money be having like different ass problems. I'm yeah, like, yeah, why are you yeah, so yeah. sad? Like why? You, <laughs> like, That's why you gotta grind, y'all have to grind. Yeah. Like yeah. if you listen to his story, he came out here no bread. Like he moved to a whole different place where he yeah. barely knew anybody yeah. you gotta grind like don't let the budget necessarily you do gotta get the budget at some point but like yeah. in the meantime grind yeah. learn yeah. network yeah. unity yeah. you see yeah. he got his boys up here yeah, he got his that. boys at unity yeah. you can you can pull all you can pull off almost the same thing at the lower level right. obviously it won't be right right you know to the same magnitude until you yeah. get that budget but yeah. you can start the groundwork before you had a budget yeah. you can't like but i'm but but the, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm gonna go ahead and keep 100 bro mm -hmm. learn how to get money man. yeah yeah like, yeah, yeah. I, mean, like I, I, I know you want to say no no yeah, yeah, keep yeah, telling yeah. they gonna have to get the money i'm just telling right, right, right. quote i'm not saying right. you're gonna do this whole shit without no budget what I'm trying yeah. to say, <laughs> lay what you can lay in the meantime, yeah. but get some money. <laughs> and and you know, like or get a loan or something. Or you know what, like learning, <laughs> learning yeah, is man. working too. Like you know what I mean. Like uh -huh. learning is working too. Like at the end of the day, um, learn the skills that you need, mm -hmm. and you're yeah. gonna need to learn how to manage money. Like if you want to yeah. do this long longevity, if you want to be a rapper that's fucking super dope, and then somebody come over here and fuck you, and you you lose all your money, cool. If that's what you want to do, <laughs> you fine. don't want that. But my advice, as you know, saying as somebody that's been doing it, and, mm -hmm. and just I mean, I'm gonna keep it 100. Learn how to manage your fucking money. Learn how True. to get money. Like, cause at the end of yeah, the day, yeah. um, music is the most entrepreneurial uh, uh, um, occupation that you could ever. Yeah, do. yeah, that's what it, I love it, it too. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 it ain't like sports. Like, if, if in sports, if you're a fucking dope ass sports. Boom! They take care of all that shit. Boom. Yeah, you get a big check. It's and you, more, and you spend it however you want. You know what I mean? Music is different. Even back in the day, when you got your music deal, they didn't tell you that was a loan. Yeah, you know that's what I'm saying? Wrong. Like that was a loan. You gotta <laughs> still do it. That's why a lot of motherfuckers is getting. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, get, get, learn how to get money. Go on the internet money. and learn how to get the fucking money. Yeah, because I mean, obviously, if you ain't got no little to no budget, you got a lot of time. So you can yeah, you can be researching, right. learning. Exactly. Networking with people. You can be learning. Like use that time. Don't be lazy. I think a lot of artists are lazy. Yeah. A lot of times they want stuff to just like fall out the sky exactly. and bless them. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So so if, if if the topic is how do you start your shit with no budget and I'm telling you, get money. <laughs> <laughs> So you get you a Birkin. So you get you a Birkin. Hey, go, 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 go to YouTube and be like, how to make money. You know what I'm saying? Listen to Birkin first. And then they'll give you fucking 10 ways to make money. You can flip this. You can get a job. You can say, you know what Shit, I mean? Uber, Lyft. Yeah, there's, like, there's plenty of ways to get Okay, boom. Now you got some money. Okay, cool. What are you going to do with the little bit of money? All right, invest in yourself a studio. Mm -hmm. Get yourself a mic. Get yourself a camera. Get yourself, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like I said, you're going you're gonna to need it because it's, if, if you really if you really ser about, serious about serious, it. Serious, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make it work. And yeah. it's so much easier it today, man. It's, it's so it's like, much easier. Oh, my God. Bro. So much easier, man. That's why, I'm, that's why I'm not going for the no budget like type of shit. Like, yeah, it's money. just most of the uh, only reason why I even – brought this up because most of like some of them be real young so they might say even develop yet obviously yeah. you you a little yeah. more, oh you better no no I, oh, but yeah. still oh. learn how to get. them yeah i'm so i'm so envious they I'm, I'm, so, I'm so envious of, of you young people right now yeah. because you are you can make money like <laughs> easy uh, you, without even leaving your career yeah exactly so get like you can make money like it's not even it's not even a question like we didn't have the internet and all this crazy dope ass shit because it was different. That like, shit was inferior as hell. When, uh, <laughs> it, right? it, it, I remember it, my phone couldn't barely load up the uh, my space and shit. I'm, I'm <laughs> working on Nokia. Oh, I'm, the, I'm, struggle, I'm, the struggle, the struggle service. You three know, nights and weekends. I almost <laughs> like it better back <laughs> then though. High Call me a nine man. girl. No, Call no, me a nine call girl. Me up the nine. He, he <laughs> loved his internet age. I don't like the internet. I, I like it how it was back uh, in the day. You gotta you gotta print your stuff up, go and hand in hand, and be like, I'm fifty fifty. Okay, from business wise, I like it. Emotionally, I don't like right. if I didn't do music and care about the business, I probably wouldn't be on social media. But it's yeah. good for business, it make right, it right. 
if you use it right, it, you, gotta, it can, you, gotta, you, you gotta use it correctly because at the same time, yeah. you got hand to hand stuff. Yeah. But, but guess what, bro? You limit it, but, but physically. But, but, but guess what, bro? Yeah. I could FaceTime you, bro. And, and right. I could, I could face, I'll be like, hey, man, like, blah, blah, yeah. like, you know what I mean? Like, oh, like, and then we could. Yeah. Yeah, like but you know what? It's like like your followers and stuff. Everything is like less personal now. Like it is, man. It is. You know that's saying? like that's why really I said emotionally. I don't like it emotionally. Exactly. But business wise, so right, I'm fifty right. fifty on it. Yeah. yeah. But 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 then it's like like we had just talked earlier about earlier. Like we've known each other for a, a while now. You oh, know yeah. what I'm saying? Wow. And, and just, we feel like we know each other. Yeah. You know? But <laughs> so we so never. That, but see, this is the first time so good, we've good. met each other. Exactly. You know what I mean? That's dope. Um. And another another thing I do too. Also, like with everybody online. I, I get on video chats and I FaceTime them. Like, I don't, right. you know what I'm saying? Like, mm. oh, is that what you're doing? But I, I go live, <laughs> but yeah, like, yeah. I, I make. I better learn this. Up I, this up. I, 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 I switch, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, how you were saying, like, I agree with what you were saying. Like, yeah. you're able to, you know, see somebody, you know, face to face and, right. and, you know, interact with them. But shit, man, a motherfucker in Atlanta, I FaceTime. Like, I don't even know this guy from, like, you know what I'm saying? These different places. Right. But, but we can get on video chats. And I feel like I'm, I'm right there with him, you know what I mean? Right. But then when, when we finally meet, it's like, yo, I, yo, I already, know, I already know who you are, you feel right, me? Right. You feel me? And you know it's crazy? Because back in the day, like, I got a short little story I want to tell. Let's go. Like, I had this record out back, back when, you know what I'm saying? And, and it came out. We had very small radio play. And I went to this club. We had this little performance. Somebody walked up to me. Mind you, there was no social media, no uh -huh. nothing, <laughs> no cameras at the station, really, or none of that. Uh-huh. So a guy walks up to me and he says, yo, you're the one on that song and such and such. I'm like, how do you know that? <laughs> right. You ain't never seen me. Like, we had no super promo going on. So yeah. it's like, to how it was back then versus now, it's like, I don't I don't get none of that. Like, Damn. doing the radio and, right. you know, doing uh -huh. doing the music, producing records, working with different artists. Like, right. nowadays, people people won't even walk up to you and say, hey, they know you. They act like they don't know you. Back in jail, but they, yeah. then, they, then they go in the car and get on the phone and like go that. on your Instagram. Yeah, yeah. You, you just, know, so I, like, I, like, I go through the I same thing, it. bro. I think you just have to find a balance. Like, <laughs> right. like for me, too, that's why, like, um, I'm not, like I said, like, business-wise, I like social media. Emotionally, I don't. Right. So... How I found a balance, like, I can't, me personally, I can't be on social media just, like, eating a bowl of noodles today. I got to have some reasoning. I don't Man. even like talking unless I'm talking with a purpose. Yeah. So, I found a balance. Okay, if I'm entertaining and helping people, inspiring people, that's the only way I can, like, emotionally like it. Right. You know what I mean? Like, even with the radio stuff, like, you meet yeah, me outside, yeah. I don't really tend to talk for no reason. Exactly. So, yeah. you just got to find that balance, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? And independent artists, get y'all some money, get some, get y'all Bergen. Yeah. <laughs> hey, and we looking for some interns, too, if y'all some yeah, young yeah. And yeah, yeah, that's another thing, too. Wow, you can yeah. intern, like, go network, you can intern for exactly. free, learn yeah. some gyms, yeah. learn the gym, shit. Yeah. They, may have, they may even help you out if you cool. Have some character, too, because a lot of right, people right. have some character. Yeah. So, if you ain't got no character, nobody want to be around you. So. Yeah, stand, stand for something, man. Yeah. So, definitely with my story, man, I came out here and I was on the street team and I worked for free. Like, Gangsta. I worked free? for free. You hit that for free. 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 You, you learned a lot, didn't you? For free. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the main thing about it is you just want to be next to the people that's, you know what I'm saying, getting it. Like, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Exactly. Like, uh, experience is the best thing ever. Like, mm -hmm. uh, um, you can read all the books, you can watch all the YouTube videos, but ain't nothing like experience. Yeah. And just, right. just put yourself in a position to get, the, get that experience, you know what I mean? Right. So, same yeah. here, man. I did internship, and um, you know, I, I I pretty much I knew I was overqualified to be an intern, mm -hmm. so I just showed my value, and you know, they had to act, they had to, you know, take it for what it was worth, man. Because yeah. if you if you got somebody that's new that's bringing more to the table, it's like, man, how can you just keep them as an intern? Yeah. And you I'm know what I'm saying? Right now for Cash Valley. You yeah. intern yeah. for Cash Valley. Yeah, I'm yeah, intern yeah, for Cash Valley too. But, yeah, we all intern. <laughs> shit, I'm an intern too. What you, you talking about? You feel me? <laughs> hey, yo, but uh, we got a few qualified. more minutes for the for the show, so you know we're okay. gonna play. You know what? Independent artists get you some money. If you want to get inspired to get some money, yeah, you have to listen to this Birkin right here. Birkin. Yeah, yeah, you need that inspiration, this entertainment Birkin's inspiration. No no get it? No Big up Nova, bless. Mm -hmm. no.
For the content. Oh, oh, that burgers, shit all burgers, hot. All burgers, all burgers, all burgers, all burgers. <laughs> that we burgers, shit hot. Tell them where to find it at one more time. Tell them where to find it Spotify, Chris time. Cash, Birkins, Birkins, Chris Cash, Spotify, Nova Bless, Cash Belly Music, Spotify, Apple Music. Go on my Instagram, Chris Cash mm -hmm. underscore Vegas. Go to Cash Belly Music. You can find yeah, it. Yeah. Just go ahead and search up Birkins, Chris Cash. <laughs> oh, before we sign yeah. out, shout out to the homies that swap hop this shit. It's yeah. flame. Yeah, Follow them on IG. There's some like. Some like some. flavor beer. I'm not no beer kind of sewer, but it's like some flavor kind of beer and oh, shit. Right. Like flame. Oh, yeah, yeah, I might bring some next time. I'm gonna have y'all again. Oh yeah. But follow them. Swap yeah. hops on IG. S it's S W A P H O P S. Follow them too. Like uh, they, there's some dope dudes. I might bring them on the show. Whatever. Next time. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna have some for y'all though. So uh, yes, we out. You yeah. know what I mean? Get y'all social medias one more time. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, oh. yeah. I just want to, you know, promote my show, you know, yeah. nothing but net, that's radio <laughs> yeah. tonight. Monday, I'm dropping that Birkin, DJ yeah. Cali boy at Whoop. DJ Cali B O I. Holla at me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. follow me on the IG. Yeah. Sadell underscore notes. That's S E D A L E underscore notes. And be looking out for that hashtag. Notes. <laughs> there you go. Coming soon. Drug rap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chris Cash, Cash Valley Music. Birkins, 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 Birkins. That's his new single. It's getting played mm -hmm. everywhere. We yeah. just dropped the thing yesterday. Yeah. Uh, it's going crazy right now. Birkins, Birkins, Birkins. Chris Cash. Follow me on Instagram. Chris Cash underscore Vegas. Got the Birkins single on there. Birkins on Birkins on Birkins. Get it on Spotify. Cash Valley Music. Vegas Life. Vegas. Yeah. Chris Cash. <laughs> Cash Let's Music. Get it. Let's get it. Hey. Let's Let's get get it. Chain gang. Independent artist. Yeah. Mortal the story. Get you some money, money so you can get you a Birkin. But no, yeah. yeah, like listen to these dudes. They real experienced. They know what they talking about. You know what I mean? Appreciate so I'm definitely going to yeah. have them on some more. So you already know we what it is. You, yeah. Frequent. Thank you, brother. We appreciate yeah. you. Birkins Yee. on Birkins on Birkins on Birkins. Birkins, Cash on, Birkins on Birkins on Cash. Birkins. Chris Cash. Birkins. Foul. Ooh, Boom. Good. Ah. Yeah, man, that's uh, 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 I live in the moment, I'll be I know, in the man. moment promoting the life. Women are on it, I really be on it, I really be on it. I'm really in Vegas, I'm really gonna show it. Hey, can we get a pick all together? Let's get a pick. Are we still live? We still live? Uh, uh. Hey, I need a pick too.